much easier to balance if you have your shoes and socks off because you can find more relationship to the earth. So if you're willing to stand up and have your feet kind of sort of parallel to each other, feel free to join us at home, please. And you can look down to see if they are kind of sort of parallel to each other. And kind of sort of is good enough. So parallel means they're straight? Yeah, it could be the second toes to the middle of the heel, outer foot, inner heel. It depends on your feet. And you can take the weight a little further forward and a little further back until you find like both on the balls and on the heels, soft knees, outer feet, inner feet. And you're really bringing your awareness to your relationship to the earth, from the core of you to the earth, through your legs, through your tail. And in balance, one of the things I would like us to notice is that it's not a place. If you hold your breath and tighten your skin and try to make yourself not move, this is not balance. Yeah, this it feels is called rigid. rigid. Yeah. 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 It's not fun, is the bottom line. You are living, breathing, living, breathing, cells breathing, happy smile, good. Everything's nice. Nothing mm -hmm. wrong. Have a good time. Close eyes without interfering with the body's desire, willingness, and natural movement, feel how you weight shift, even on two legs. Let it. Balance is not a place. Balance is a process. It's an experience, and it's a territory. Notice, in addition to your feet, also, the whole of your head, the crown of your head, has relationship to the sky. That's not your eyes, it's not your chin. It's the crown of your head as though a lotus were blooming on the top of your head. Notice you have inside your body and notice you have outside your body. You can probably feel each other. And when you're ready, open your eyes. Notice how you feel. Stay fluid, stay easy. The Yoga Sutras, the second book, 46 verse, it's Sviram Sukhamasana. Steady and easy. Steady and easy is your practice. Steady and easy is headstand. Steady and easy is bending. So you're gonna take a leg as you move weight from one side to another. One of those legs is gonna ground deeply into the earth, grow roots, spread. Your roots are big. When you're ready, weight shift. You still have toes on the ground, or ball of the foot on the ground, soft knees. And then lift the other leg up. Wherever you want to put it, you can put it. Wherever you want to put it, you can put it. Yeah, bring arms out. Mm -hmm. Stay show me. Oh, it's kind of tight. <laughs> Don't bring arms out. And you can put yourself completely off balance to see what you do. And that's learning how to balance. Because we know babies fall. The willingness to fall and the practice in not falling. Practice in falling, getting up, practice in not falling. There's two ways to balance. You can move your foot around. Or you can let your hands go. Yeah. All right. All right. Go. See? You rock. <laughs> so, that's our yoga practice and balance for today. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. Namaste. Namaste.